35 years, we've served customers in Boilermaker Country, and we want to serve you with pre-owned vehicles from $29.50 and up. Online at TwinCitySuperstore.com. Linebacker Joe Holland. Joe, you're, uh, what, a week or so, I suppose, into uh, training camp here. How are things going? Uh, going very well. Yeah, today marks uh, the one week, so we're you know right in the heart of it. Um, but everything's going real well. Uh, I know defensively we have uh, you know a young secondary, but we have a lot of experienced guys up front, and uh, you know the young kids in the secondary really coming along, really showing a lot of promise. So uh, we're all excited about that. What about the linebackers? I mean, you guys have maybe one of the deepest crews in, in a while, and certainly the deepest crew since you've been here. Just be pretty happy with what you see out of them? Absolutely. We have a, uh, an experienced group of guys, which is something that we haven't had the last couple of years. Um, you know, we have six guys that can, you know, go on the field at any given time and play good football. So uh, I know our coaches are really excited about that. But at the same time, that does, uh, you know, we're, expect we're a little more is expected this year. Um, so we're all very excited about the challenge. And, um, you know, it's just nice to know the guys next to you have, have had game experience and know what they're doing. You can trust them and they can trust you. It's certainly got to be a different feeling than a couple of years ago when about this time you were being shuttled down from safety and sort of a stop gap when you guys had barely any, any depth at linebacker. It's got to be different than that, right? Uh, very different feeling. You know, even from, even from last year where uh, some, some very minor things, you know, as setting the strength or right. making the calls was an issue. Um, now with the, our experience, you know, we don't have to worry about the little things. We can just worry about playing football and, and playing well. How has Dwayne Beckford done moving over to middle? You know, I forget that he's a true sophomore all the time just right. because of how commanding he is in the field, uh, on the field. He, uh, he's doing a, a tremendous job right now, kind of taking control of the defense. And uh, he's really starting to understand the defense, understand what's going on around him. And he's, he's doing a great job. How are you feeling? I mean, this is your third year now as a, a full-time linebacker and things. you got to be more and more comfortable as far as, you know, the physicality of the position and things as every day passes, right? Absolutely. I, uh, this is the first year where I'm really satisfied with the weight, with my weight going into the season. Uh, I weigh 230 right now, which is exactly what I wanted to weigh. And, uh, yeah, just, you know, the experience I've had on, out on this field makes me more and more comfortable every single day uh, in practice, you know, making the right checks, making the right calls, and just being able to play fast instead of thinking about what I have to do. How critical is it that you guys stop the run this year? And, and, and where in doing that does the linebacker's responsibility fall? Um, that is absolutely, you know, one of the main emphasis of this defense for this year is stopping the run. And, um, you know, that really – and it's the entire defense has got to be part of that. But, of course, you know, people look at the linebackers when it comes to stopping the run. Um, so that's something we're definitely going to have to have to focus on. We're going to have to all play fast, play physical, and um, just do all that we can. To, uh, <coughs> excuse me. You know, we have a great defensive line in front of us. We know that. Uh, so, you know, if we do our job, we know they'll do their job. And, you know, I think we can have success in doing that this year. What do you think will be the difference this year in being able to do it more successfully? Will it be scheme? Is it is it just that you guys are a little bit bigger and more experienced or a combination of all of the above? I, you know, I think experience will have a lot to do with it. Uh, you know, you look at any of the big runs we gave up last year, you know, it's the difference between taking a guy on your left shoulder and your right shoulder. It's, it's always a very small thing. Um, and, you know, with experience, you know, those mistakes we hope aren't going to happen again this year. So if we can just correct those very small mistakes, we hope that we can put a stop to the big plays. Any of those young linebackers uh, who all seem pretty talented stand out to you? <laughs> we got a lot of talented young linebackers. Will Lucas um, is, you know, he's another guy. He was here in the spring, so I kind of forget that he's <laughs> only going into his first year of college football. But he's a, uh, he's a fast linebacker, and he, uh, he's all over the place. And uh, Joe Gilliam. Uh, out of Southport is another guy who he hasn't gotten a ton of reps this, uh, this fall so far, but every time he's out there, he's made a play, and I think he's grabbing some attention. Thanks a lot, Joe. All right, thank you.